When we started Jack Irwin, we were extremely naive. You know, we didn't come from the fashion world. All that we knew was that we really wanted to make beautiful, well-made shoes and sell them at a price that made sense to us, a price that we could pay. My name is Ariel Nelson, co-founder of Jack Irwin. And my name is Lane Gerson. I'm the other co-founder of Jack Irwin. And Jack Irwin is a uh, men's dress shoe company. We sell high quality, really clean, simple, well-made dress shoes uh, direct to consumers. And our investors wanted us to make progress in both our website and our shoes in order to fund us. We kind of got to this juncture where we needed to go to Portugal in order to make final corrections on our samples. Our investors really weren't going to fund until they got these final production shoes. But also we needed to put down a deposit so that they could actually go into production on our shoes. That deposit was going to be about $250,000. Once we got to Portugal, it became quite apparent that we were not going to be getting funding from our investors. We had to launch and so we kind of had one shot to do it, um, and so we pretty much put all of our chips on the table and, and just went for it. We, we knew that if we weren't going to production now, we would never be able to go into production. Luckily, our factory came to us and they said, your bank is not affiliated with our bank. Once you get home, do you mind wiring the funds? Then, at that moment, I don't know what we would have done if we had to wire the funds. And we were just kept pushing, pushing things forward, hoping that the right thing would happen. So this was another one of those moments that really allowed us to create this company. When you go for something, there's always a kind of a, a way to, to figure out a way through that, that roadblock. It wasn't like, this is a dead end, it'll be a dead end. It was like, how can we, how can we solve this problem, what, whatever comes next. Being motivated by our passion and always persistently pushing through was the reason all this came to fruition.